So in this problem, we're told to find the limit, if it exists, of the limit as t approaches infinity of the square root of t plus t squared over 8t minus t squared. So in order to find the limit as some variable approaches infinity, what you want to do is look at the variable to the highest degree on the top and bottom. So in this case, it's going to be t squared on top, right? Because t squared goes to a higher degree than the square root of t. So I'm going to write t squared right here. And then on the bottom, t squared is higher degree than 8t. So I'm going to write minus t squared. And make sure you include a variable out in front. These are just one. But in, if you had a variable, you make sure you include it when you write it like this. And then if you have, um, if they go to the same uh, exponent, right? So this one goes squared and this one goes squared. What you're going to want to do in order to find the limit is just look at the coefficient out front on top and divide it by the one on the bottom. So in reality, there's a one here. We just don't see it. So it would be one divided by, and then right here we have a minus one. We just don't see the one. So it's one divided by minus one. So that's going to be equal minus one. So the limit or the answer to this uh, limit is going to be minus one.